I am so suspicious of Ren right now. I. <laughs> this is some like leading us into a trap type thing. She definitely does look a little bit like sad as she's talking. One of us is gonna die at this particular place. Okay. Hi. That's my job. That's my job, fucker. <laughs> I die at everything. Okay, so then besides your little conversation, um, I want you guys to roll me a d12. One of you guys. I cannot, I cannot express how like sus she is to me. <laughs> uh, did you roll, or should I roll? Just oh, you one of you guys. You want to? I'll do it. I usually get good rolls. <laughs> <laughs> I got a seven. Hey, that's a above average roll for you. It is. <laughs> Anything higher than a one is good. <laughs> it is again fairly quiet. There is a bit of ruffling in the in the bushes. You can hear the hoots of owls, the chirps of some birds, howls of wolves. But again, overall, very quiet night. The stars are very visible as well. You can see the constellations in the sky. Um, as you end your watch and wake up, growl. Uh, time to fucking watch. Who will now. It sounds like a buffer. computer starting <laughs> <laughs> Noah, you ready? Or are you just not feeling it? In terms of, like, recording ability? Yeah. He's getting his dial up internet ready. Okay. I'm just making sure that you get your audio is going weird for me. Uh, anyways. I hear. I, I know you're here. I can sort of hear you. Anyways. Um, hey, we're all good. Okay, so growl. You've been woken up. The fire, I wouldn't say it's roaring, but it is still warm. Um, you sit uh, right. in I the night die again. and you hear... Not at first, but as yeah. your watch starts yes. to progress, the whispers. The whispers that you've heard every other night since they first I'm appeared I'm ready. the night I'm after Izil felt drained. I'm you hear them. Yeah, I but the whispers are broken okay. for someone will appear, but oh, wait, we're going to take a moment to flash mm -hmm. all the way back to Alice Falls. Where Tassa, after aiding some folks, has gone ahead and headed to the bar to All Man's Ale. There, she found a note. The note <sighs> said, "Oh wait, just give me a moment. Editing things. I hate my internet. Okay, Can unmute I yourself, test, Anna. Test. Hello. What did I miss? Da -ba -da -da. Yo, what did I miss? A lot. Uh, we're about to introduce. So we're introducing you. Um, Hi, and Alice I'm Falls. here. Um, Regrettably, this is all gonna be have to be edited out. But anyways, uh, in Alice Falls, Anna, not Anna, two, <laughs> in at All Man's Ale in Alice Falls, Tassa, after aiding some people who actually lived further out of the city than not the city, shoot, out of the town than she thought. Um, she's gotten back. She has gone ahead and uh, went to the inn, as planned. Realizing that her friends aren't there, immediately she goes to the barkeep, and the barkeep hands her a note. Tassa, you now have a note in your hand, which tells you um, there is an amulet. The amulet is also Hi, in I your other you. hand, as it has been passed to you. Oh, it looks might. like a fragment of some kind of maple leaf amulet of some kind. And it says, the note? Well, how about, uh, Cormus? You tell me what's on the note. All right, the note reads, Tasa, we ran into someone, we ran into a new, new person that we're gonna, that we're helping out for a little while. Her name's Ren. She's got a crow that is really creeping me out. We're going out, <laughs> She's being hunted by some witch, so we're going out into the woods to try and take her down. 
it still says this amulet is going to let you know, is going to guide you to us. Cormus. P.S. Don't be freaked out by the voice. The what? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, that's a surefire way to get me freaked out about the voice right there. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> you okay, are there. Um, what do you want to do? Well, it said the amulet was going to guide me to where <laughs> Don't be freaked out by the, voice. the rest of the party. Says. Yes. It yes, it, it, it will guide you to us. Okay, so... That's not very specific. Um, so like, um, how? How would, is it, do I just like look at it and it's gonna be like they're right there or something like that, or is it? Well, you 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 put feel as you look at the amulet, you have a the very slightest feeling that you should put it on. Okay, I'll put it on. You just hear this voice, Lady Sparkbonk. I'm very pleased to make acquaintance with you. If we're acquaintances, may I ask that you never call me Lady Sparkbonk ever again? My apologies, Tassa. <laughs> Thank Spark you. Sparkbonk. Now, I would just like to say your friends are currently doing well, although I must say your friend Growl might be in need of your um, Silver Raven. Oh, okay. Either way, uh... I'm very pleased. Uh, we will need to talk about things after this, but until then, I told Azil that I would get you to them. Okay. Are you prepared? Uh, sure. And you just feel like you disintegrate almost, but you don't disintegrate. You notice that you just sort of turn into leaves, and everybody Thanos. in the inn looks at you, and you just, as you turn into a pile of leaves. Do you know you're not a pile of leaves? Because you wake up in the forest. It is dark. You're standing and you hear this voice saying, just go to the fire. I'd recommend that you go help. You, you can see that there is a fire past some trees. Okay. Do you walk towards them? Towards it? I'll walk towards it, sure. As you get near the fire, you see... And Growl, you will see your friend Tassa enter the clearing. Tassa, you just see Growl. Where the fuck have uh, you been? I I'm assuming Growl, you are you have just been you have not seen her this whole time. Um, but you have been haunted by the voices, so I assume I assume that you have been in the corner, kinda crouching no, protecting I'm just, yourself. No, I've just been kinda sitting there, accepting my fate at this point. Okay. I'm just been sitting on like the logs, just like, yep, this is it, this is where I die. Alright, I'll bring it. You doing okay. okay over there? Uh... No, I'm fine. <laughs> okay. You still hear whispers in your head. It's in my head. It's fine. <laughs> the main <laughs> did problem. You wanna, did you want to well, borrow my raven? You know what? Mm, I'm good this time. He's lost <laughs> it, guys. He's lost it. <laughs> <laughs> All of us are just... Oh. Okay. You see the bodies of everyone else just sort of sleeping on the ground. Plus one. Plus one. Plus one, yes. Ren Renzo. Uh, uh, a red-haired um, half-elf. Oh, whack. I would say hi, but they're asleep. <laughs> I mean, you can still say hi. I mean, there's not really much point. Um, there is a raven also, uh, like, right beside her. So oh. That's eyeing you curiously as you approach. Raven pals? What the heck? Or, sorry, crow. Okay. What's the name for that group of uh, birds? Corvids? Corvids. Yeah, Corvids. Yes. Corvid, Corvid pals. Hell yeah. Cormus with the Corvids. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> <laughs> During COVID. Corvus and the Corvid. <laughs> Anyways, Tassa. Yeah? Where the fuck have you been? I was helping some people fix stuff, and they uh, were a little more out of town than they said they were originally. Um, but Did you I charge mean, more for that. Yeah, obviously, I got good some stuff. You, you, you know. got you got uh, thirty gold pieces from that. Congratulations! Yeah, I got thirty Tatha. gold pieces from it. It's not gold. Like... 
How many my gold rates, pieces? I do good work, I'll have you know. It's worth quite I a bit. My sleep at the sun, how much money do you even have right now, Tessa? Like, how off are you now? Uh, fairly well off, I'd say. Um, let me just check my wallet. My little bag thingy. It's somewhere in here. <laughs> Take your time. Pulls um, up. I think I have a few rubies worth a hundred gold. I have ten platinum, and then another like a hundred and thirty-ish gold. Damn. All right, I don't know if I can compete with that. I've been I've been taking odd jobs here and there. You should try it. All right, let me see how much uh, money I how, how do I like coin? Why are we please, comparing? Please fucking tell like, me coins don't have weight. I just want this. Is, I think this is funny. I also don't have anything else to do. So, I'm just gonna fast forward through you guys. Com you guys spend the night comparing how much money you have and how rich you are. His dick is bigger. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's Tass's. Money dick. Are you sure about that? <laughs> you wanna compare? In terms of money? No. <laughs> No, in terms of dick size. You want to compare? I, I give me a minute. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> <laughs> the night goes on, and uh, luck with your with the uh, although you had kind of accepted your fate with the voices, um, you find that they're not. It's not as horrible with your friend, uh, or you're yeah. at least. I don't know if Grau would consider her his friend. Your acquaintance, comrade, at least. Right there, yeah. So day comes, and everybody is up. Um, I would, how about we do a quick little Ren meets Tass, a little snippet, and then we get moving on to Mama's house. Alright. Who? So, Whose uh, house? Mama's house. Like you know <laughs> Old lady's house. Are you, why'd you call her mom? Because it's a, <laughs> well, have <laughs> you not weird. heard of, like, Mama Tucker has been, like, a name for, like, old ladies who are, like, no. witches? No? No. No. Really? No. no. You no. need to read more witch books. I've heard plenty of witch books. <laughs> it's like mothers, which, which grannies. Which book are you talking about? Okay, anyways. <laughs> okay, whatever. Anyways, let's just. Let's just yeah. Oh, um, hello. Hi. Um, nice Hi. to meet you. You too. Um, I'm I'm Ren. This is Sir Lysander Abington. Um, <laughs> he gives like a little bow to you. Very polite. When he's introduced. He is. He, he really is. Um, nice. Who are you? Uh, my name's Tassa. Uh, I, I'm a friend, I guess, of these people. Um, uh, I, I took an odd job, and it turned out to be uh, a bit of an odder job than I thought. It was a little further out than they said it was, and ended up getting a little bit lost. Um, but it, it should be fine. Um, Alright, well, glad, glad you're here now. Um, nice me you uh, we should get going shouldn't we probably yeah tassa would you like to quickly describe yourself to ren oh sure so uh tassa is a gnome um she's about three foot five inches uh she has purple hair that's in a high ponytail and she's got fairly long hair um she's fairly tan um and then hmm lacking a pair of goggles apparently she wears fairly <laughs> casual clothes. Doesn't have any armor on yet. She has a dent in her head. She also has a dent in her head, yes. That's a fairly prominent feature. I mean, it's it's subtle, but if once you notice it, you, you really notice it, and you're like, oh, what the fuck? Uh, Ren politely does not mention that. <laughs> Thank you. Tassa okay. appreciates that Ren either didn't notice it or did not acknowledge it. So, you guys make up camp. You head out, and it isn't m much longer, only a few hours, till you reach the site of a cottage on a tiny little stream. Just give me a moment, I'm trying to get up my reference image that I made. I made a reference map of what the area kind of looks like, but, yeah. Ah, uh, ba da ba da there we go. Also, as we've been traveling, Ren has been growing visibly more distressed. Awesome. I did not like that. Nice. Okay, uh, you reach a. Cl it's a semi clearing. Um, there are, there is this tiny little hut, not very big, which sits 
in the middle of this clearing, bit off the edge of the tiny little stream that bubbles by. You, uh, what is everyone's passive perceptions? Actually, no, Ardran, we are, Ardan, we already know, uh, you are pretty darn good. Yeah. So, I would like to let you know, um, that something seems amiss. You are definitely certain. The doors don't look like they have just been left alone. Maybe it looks like someone's kind of left in a hurry. You don't see any lights on inside the house. And you also uh, smell something off, although you're not really sure what it is. But it isn't coming from the house. It's coming from somewhere behind the house. You stand in front of the building. There is a door. What would you guys like to do? I'm going to tell the firm and say, there's something's off about this place. It seems like someone's left in a hurry and I smell something suspicious. Hmm. You should probably be careful. Cormus is going to scan the, the woods nice. behind us, see if I see anyone walking up behind us. No, oh, you, man. you are certain there is no one behind you. It is clear. It is bright today. The sun is out. It's a bit frosty, but overall the temperature is pretty nice. Yeah, it's all clear. You don't see anything. Hey, Growl, how are those voices right now? What? <laughs> they saying anything? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what would you guys like to do? I, I have been meaning to do this for a bit. I, I like I walk over to Cormus and like really hush like, Hey, Cormus, I don't... Something seems fishy about Ren. That's just my opinion. So I'll... Um... I'll stick in the back of the group. Okay. Okay. Now, are you guys going to head Bro wants to, to sniff. Noah wants to sniff? Mm -hmm. uh, Noah, ha is your voice recorded saying that you want to sniff? Yes, I have. Okay. Okay, cool. I was just waiting for an audio thing because otherwise I don't want it to be like I acted on it and you oh, didn't no, say no, anything. Oh, no, no, no. I just wasn't speaking because I figured out my ping was dead. Oh, you're back okay. now. Oh, yeah, excellent. Well, yeah, I want to roll perception on the smell. Uh, okay, well, you don't. You didn't smell the smell. Hard time smelled the smell. Okay, well, I want to roll to see if I can. Well, I, told out every, I told everyone. Yeah, he told, he told me. Okay. Uh, well, you know what? Uh, Growl, what's your passive perception? <laughs> My passive perception is 15. Okay, so you, you're, you're able to just yeah. sort of. By focusing on this, you walk around the building, you make your way behind the house. Start sort of looking around at the ground, and then you see there's a spattering trail of blood that's leading up, oh, up and away from the stream, and back into the woods on the other end of the house. Mm. It's not a big trail, but it's like little droplets every now and then that are still relatively noticeable. Um, don't like that. I'm going to yell to everyone that there's, hey, uh, dudes, there's, uh, there's a trail of blood back here. Mm. Oh. That's what the smell is. Was that there when I ran away from the... Um... Oh no, definitely not. Okay, um... The house looks quieter than when you were last there. That's uh, new. Cormus draws Things just story. seem very off. Don't like that. That wasn't here should when we, I left. Should, should we try, like, talking to her before we just go in gun blazing? Well, she's That's a murderer. Right. She deserves no okay. speech. I don't know. And I still suggest, because we don't, we like never do this, try to detain the person. We don't necessarily have to kill the person. Didn't we try that like the crime of murder is punishable anyway? by death? She's, she has magic. She, she can manipulate you. She can, the crime if you give her a chance to talk to you, punishable by death. if you give her a chance to talk to you, she'll, wait, you might didn't not want to talk to her? I did. And then I found out she was going to kill me. Sus. Wait, that's sus as shit. <laughs> I just... <laughs> I'm calling you! I'm calling you! Like, that's leading us here to die! No, Hold on. no. Are you, so you guys are standing in front of the house, by the way. Okay, I need to... Uh, the door is open very slightly. Okay, I need to confess something before we... That's very suspicious, the fact that you admit you talked to her, but then you also admit she has mind control magic. So I I'm just going to say right now, I unsheathed my weapon. Let her talk. Weapons. Let her talk. I need to admit something. I lived here for a while before I found out what she was doing. Okay, so longer exposure to mind control. And... It was Lysander that helped me get out. 
he's the one who made me realize something was wrong. He's the one who convinced me to leave, and he's the one who showed me that she was killing people. Fucking times, my fucking wife. It's fucking dumb. It's like, hmm. How do we not know? How do we know you're not a plant to come get more people to be? Yeah, this is this is this is really sus. I don't blame you for not trusting me, but what can I do to prove it? I honestly don't know. Ardhan isn't the best wait, no, wait, no, about this. No, I do know. I do know oh, how to prove it. Oh, he does. I have zone of truth. Okay. <laughs> oh, you just now. Okay. Every single time that it comes to using Zone of Truth, there's a moment where he's like, I don't know what to do, and then he suddenly remembers, oh, wait a moment, I've got Zone of I Truth. I can use magic. <laughs> it's just like last time that you had this problem with, like, oh, we're just going to torture him, we're going to torture him. Oh, wait a moment. <laughs> yeah. I have Zone of Truth. <laughs> I always forget how useful this spell is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Right. Um, I'll, I'll willingly fail the saving throw for that. Excellent. Alright, so I'm going to cast my second level spell, Zone of Truth, around this area. That we are all standing in. Does everybody else want to, like, make the saving throws or fail the saving throw? <laughs> Do you want to um, try to save? I'm or not I'll saving throw. throw I this don't shit. care. I, I am going to make the saving throw. I will also make the saving throw. What happens if... What happens if I don't? I failed the saving throw. 12. Then you must tell the truth. What's you the cannot saving speak a lie well in the radius. What was okay. The, well, I'm not gonna... The, I don't plan on lying. What saving throw is it? What saving throw is it? It's, 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 it's a charisma saving throw. Ah, shit, dude. Fuck, okay, I got a 9. <laughs> yeah, I got a 14. Charisma, you have to beat a... You have to beat a... Where is it? You have to beat a 14. I mean, if it's on you, Ardan, does that mean that you also need to make the save, or no? I tied. Oh, I... I... I think, I don't know. I got a 21. I think it's every creature, so I think I do. I don't okay, uh, well, we're just gonna run off that you don't need to because you're the guy casting it for now. Okay. Um, so pretty much you know that everybody but Tassa failed the save. Okay, great. Oh no, wait, what's your spell save DC? 14. Um, so yeah, uh, Noah matched, Growl matched, um, since so he's a player, you know what, he also doesn't need to tell you the truth. So you know that Tassa and Growl mm -hmm. both... Um, aren't gonna are able to lie to you. I can tell okay. a lie right now. Why would you? I, can't I lie don't know. Shit. Okay, so I'm gonna ask. I'm gonna ask Ren. Well, you were in. Well, while you were staying with the witch, at any point were you complicit to any of her schemes? Sorry, can you repeat that? Uh, while you were staying with the witch. At any point, were you complicit to any of her schemes? Not knowingly. Not knowingly. Were you unknowingly complicit to any of her schemes? <laughs> she she know? wanted me to help people. She, she wanted me to invite people to help them when they were lost and scared. I didn't know what she was doing, though. Did, were you ever suspicious why people were just disappearing? I thought they'd left. They would say goodbye to me and leave, and uh, I didn't know they were dead until I left. And when I found out what's going on, I think she decided it wasn't worth it to keep me around anymore. Are you currently yeah, under mind control, or at any point before you left, did you have some possible, like, subversive mind control spell cast upon you? It's possible that she used magic, but not to my knowledge. I never noticed it if she did. Yeah, anyone else have any questions? Adrian, if she is mind-controlled, like, knowingly, this is all the truth to her, mm -hmm. but it could be very much so still false. Well, how would we know? This is the best test I have. I say... Tie her up. Put her in a box. <laughs> What? what? <laughs> Do you have I a would box? Say, I mean, I'm... keeping her separate from this conflict would not be the worst decision. She, she'll kill me. Through. Yeah, but if we kill her first, that will be an issue. This still feels <laughs> so much like a trap that Ren is leading us into. Yeah, it's, that's what it's I'm feeling. Not... Listen, no, she. Please. 
Okay, so does anyone have any other questions to ask? Under the zone we of burn truth? the house down then. Does anyone have any questions to ask under the zone of truth? I don't think so. Okay. I don't have it. I don't okay. have any questions. I say we burn the house down. That's not a bad idea. You guys idea. haven't even it... entered the house, I'm just saying. And screw it, burn the house. We don't know. We're burning we don't... the house down is not a bad idea. I, I volunteer to burn the house down. I don't know if anybody is staying here or if this witch is just out for a moment. Then do you want to I mean, she has nowhere to return to. She also could have been tailing us and for a remember, while. And uh, remember, the people someone, who were here could someone be dead. hurriedly left as if they were True. as like in a rush to go somewhere. So I doubt people are still. Here. There are no downsides to committing arson in this situation. I I'm agree. going to commit arson. We down. Return this house to the lands of the forest. So we agree. We are going to burn the. We're house gonna down. burn the house down. Burn it. Excellent. Burn it. All right. Burn it. Actually, Sounds hold like on. Wait, 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 wait. Um. Should we maybe like take into consideration what happened last time people tried to burn something down? <laughs> yes, but that was no, but that was that was that was a specific circumstance. Now we're all nice and far away. It can't possibly explode. Ren can cast fire from our radius. It's fine. How close are these? Is this like um, house to the trees? Okay, okay. So yeah, okay. It should be fine. Just everyone back up. Okay. All right. Who's lighting the fire? Ren. Wait, what is this house made out of? It's, Does it have it's, sticks in it? It is, oh my God. from the outside, it appears to be a wooden cabin. Great, perfect. Ren, as a, a show of loyalty, would you mind casting fireball on the house? I don't have fireball, but I can start a small fire with fireball. That works. She looks, <laughs> like... Suspiciously at some of you now. Um, Why is she? When you recommended you tie her up and leave her in a box, like she looks scared. It's the correct decision. It's it's the correct decision. We have no reason to trust you. I know she still looks scared. We wouldn't kill you. It's look. I don't want temporary restraints. I don't think it's a great (laughs) idea. But I mean, like if it if it's what the rest of the party thinks, I guess it's fine. But I don't think. I Anyways, feel like it's, you know, it's fine. It'll be right fine. Right now, right now, arson. Arson firebolt on the house. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. The, fu- the, the house slowly ignites. As okay. it goes, it starts to burn faster and faster. Um, for those of you who are magically inept, so that would be Ren, uh, Tassa, and Ardan. Right? Uh, no, you can magic. tell magical things are burning. You hear the pop and of potions popping and cracking and burning into the smoke. That sounds like the money being burnt in there. Shit. <laughs> you hear you can you can hear spells come loose as their spell scrolls light on fire. Oh. I'm going in. You just hear no. <laughs> no, no. Whoa. <laughs> money. No. Potential money, guys. Wait, hold That's on. That's suicide. Value. I would not recommend it. And you can hear just the books burn as the place burns to the ground. The smoke, made of multiple colors, pink, green, blue, white. I am in pain. Looks nice. Why are you Mental in pain? pain. Looks nice. Why? And that is it. There is a moment, though, where you you see a tiny little, it almost looks like a goblin figure, just kind of runs out of the house, and he runs towards you, and you hear this, What the fuck are you doing? Oh, we're committing arson. Who, who are, are you? you? I was squatting here! You're gonna ruin my squat spot! How long have you been here? Damn, last night. Did he enter the zone of truth, by the way? Uh, you guys are... You know what? Sure, he entered the zone of truce. Uh, <laughs> he fails to save. Um, I'm just gonna say that the zone of the, the zone of truce is still up. I don't care. Okay. Um, like I was, I was here like last night. That was it. I'm just squatting. Squatter's right. There's no one here. There's no one here for a full day, eh? Interesting. Yeah. Want to explain the blood over there? What? <laughs> yeah, the, the blood, blood stains. I don't know. That was there when I got here. What? Has anyone bothered so to check how fresh it is? you entered a house where there's a bunch of blood outside of. I just wanted a place to sleep. You know, walking in the woods, running away from tr- 
people who want to enslave me or people who want me to do maple work. I just want to get out of here. This is great. It's out of the way. It was free. Cost me nothing. Well, now you it, burned the house to the ground. It was it was formerly owned by a can a murderous at least witch who we have decided it was better not to enter a potentially magically trapped house, so we burnt it to the ground. And now we're going to go find said murderer. Well, goddammit, but you ruined my squat spot. Get squatting another legal. one. And squatting is... Oh, and is squatting legal? In it's this, in not this, in this, illegal. In this, it's illegal? I said it's not illegal. Not also, a... this area isn't under the jurisdiction of any laws. Okay, great. No, she didn't. Sir, brother. Morally wrong, though. I mean, we could probably... Uh, I, I, I mean, I wouldn't mind helping you find another squat spot if you really needed, but like... Can you gobble? Give me like... Like five gold, I'll I'll be on my way. All right, have fun. Here's five gold. See ya. Yay! And he he takes the five gold and he just sort of like walks Witness? off. Witness? What the hell? <laughs> okay, so tie him up. So no, no, he's done nothing wrong. You don't know that. No, he was in the zone of truth. <laughs> he's done nothing wrong. <laughs> he was just squatting, the zone man. Of truth Let him. Has failed occasionally. He was just squatting. So basically. Now we have the issue of our witch has escaped and is on the run. We have What's to go get her. Track her down. Out of character question, oh, have we gone and inspected the blood stain? No. <laughs> nobody's, nobody's inspected, inspected it. it. Nobody's figured out how old it actually is. Okay, I'm gonna Cormus is gonna take a look at is gonna take a look at the blood stain. The blood turns into a mimic. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it would not be the first time something different has turned into a mimic. The, bl the <laughs> blood stain, um, are well. You can tell the blood stains are old, just from go. your experience. Like not super old, like a, a maybe a day old. Okay. Uh, it looks like a blood of a humanoid. Someone was probably stabbed and then pulled and dragged along, maybe, Should in this we direction. Follow it. Lead. Can we follow? Yo, are, is there a? Are we tracking? Is there, this is my is there, is there, We got a tracker man on this is side. There, here. Is there a trail that we can follow? There is a definite a trail that can be followed. Alright. Blood I, I swear I, to god, I, if I fucking go near the I blood, mean, I, already I said, guys. Hi. So I we have a trail try. with blood Fuck stain. That. Fuck that. Should we go check it out? Ooh, I can lead this. Alright. Track, track into a special team, my dude. Alright. I'll be in the front with you. Figure awesome. Out some, so. Out some order between the rest of you. Izil, uh, make a survival check with advantage. Hell yeah. Shit, my die. <laughs> well, it fell off the table. That's a roll. <laughs> okay, it's in between a 1 and an 18. Because that covers a carpet. Let me re-roll that. Let's go with the 18, and then you get to roll again. Oh, okay. The 18 would have been a 22, and then this is a 16. Okay, well, 22, that's fine. You, you're you able to follow this trail. It actually takes you about an hour or so. That's, so it actually goes pretty far, like two miles, a bit more than two miles up. Um, Hold on. But as you get near, you can just, you hear, you can hear a bonfire burning. Hold on, Owen. What I'm tracking, I can learn the exact number sizes and how long ago they passed through the area awesome um, so number it was sizes. A, so you can estimate some time a bit longer than a, a day ago two individuals uh, are you able to figure out what 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 type of creatures they are He says you learn exact number of sizes and how long ago they Awesome. There were, two, really. there were two things, two beings, humanoid-like. One of them was bleeding and being uh, led by the other. And they, you get to the location you, from the bushes. Uh, but once you get closer to the bonfire noises, you see a circle of stones. Six large stones and six small stones make a circle around a central area where a square is made of small stones. In the middle is a pile of wood and hay that is a light. There is a lady of 
that appears elven in some way, but is looks old-ish, but she doesn't seem to be standing old. And some and a fear bog which has blood all over him. And you hear her say, "Well, Aldrin can make it out because." It is quiet, and the bonfire is roaring, but Adran, you can just hear, I'm sorry, I need to do this for the forest, and she just throws the body, uh, she throws the fear bog into the fire. Oh, rip. Do I what do you guys want to do? Um, I'm going to tell... Oh, the by the way, what I just Ren, heard. Ren, this is, this is the lady. I cast, uh, mage the, armor the forest? On, I cast mage armor on myself. I mean, so she said she said something about doing things for the forest. Yeah, what does the lady exactly look like, Owen? She is a hunched over, uh, but semi-young looking, uh, like a middle-aged looking elf lady uh, with blonde hair with some red streaks in it. Some facial features look a tiny bit like Ren, but not exactly. Yo, Ren, is this your mom? I run out and cast Phantasmal Force on her. Uh, I'm going to try <laughs> and stop her, because so I feel sus. like there's some stuff we have to talk about here. It's too late. She's making, she gets a surprise round, I and then everybody gets a roll right, we shouldn't have trusted her. God. So, Ren, wow. Ren, I wonder if uh, someone does, said we shouldn't have We should have tied her up, we should have tied her up, we've messed up. <laughs> what does Phantasmal Force do? Um, so I create an illusion in the mind of a creature I can see within 60 feet of me. And they must make an intelligence saving throw, DC 15. You fucked. Okay. Fucking hell. <laughs> you were right. Um... What, what type of saving throw? Intelligence. Intelligence, okay. She just fails. Okay, then she sees a... giant crow come down and start trying to peck her eyes out. And she takes one second. Well, um, time to learn some. I'm gonna go over my own spells right here. <laughs> oh, meanwhile, while you're all waiting, everybody else roll initiative for me and just put it in the chat. I need to roll high on this. The god of D and D. So Fuck she you, D and D. Okay, so she believes that this is um, completely true, and she takes. Um, 1d6 damage every turn as long as she's near it, but she fully believes that it's real. Okay, so can she move away from the crow, or is it just sort of like... Or the raven, whatever it is. <laughs> right, she can move away from it, but she... does think it's true, so if she'd probably try to focus on that as a main threat. Okay, is there a way to dispel it, or does it just stay forever? I'm just wondering. It lasts for one minute, but it's concentration, and she can Okay. use her action to make an investigation check to tell if it's an illusion. Okay. And she takes five damage this round. She takes five damage, got it. She screams a bit, and ah! she looks at you and is like, Oh, how dare you, daughter! Okay. Oh shit! I also called that. <laughs> okay, that's uh. And everybody some gets explaining. to roll initiative. Yeah. I Isil is just right today. I mean, like, uh, she didn't real, say man. she didn't actually <laughs> specify how long she lived with her, right? Like, <laughs> I I'm... am a fucking knowledgeable god. Today. <laughs> okay, so. Ren has mommy issues. Mm. Uh. <laughs> oh, dude, relate, relate. <laughs> this, this, <laughs> this, this is the session of parent issues. <laughs> <laughs> this is the session of parent issues. Um, <laughs> pretty good, actually. Good. <laughs> Family gets along. <laughs> okay, all done. done. It is your turn. You see, uh, Ren has just ran forward, and this lady is now trying to bat something right. away from her face, which who's, appears. Wait, whose turn is this, sir? It is your turn. My turn. Okay. Um, um yes. I'm going to cast command um which sorry one second command here it is 
uh, um, when I can see a creature within the range, I speak a one-word command. The target of the the target must succeed a wisdom saving throw, or it must follow the command on its next turn. Oh, so I'm gonna command, is, what um, is the range? Ren, stop. Okay, what's the range? The range. Yeah. Sixty feet. Okay, yeah, no, you can definitely hit Ren. Yeah. Can I drop concentration as a reaction? Uh. Where does it say that? Or so. can I like? Okay, then I'll drop concentration as soon as it's my turn. Well, no, as a reaction, if you fail, um, he he needs to make you need to make a save against it unless you don't want to. Uh, so apparently, so you can end concentration at any time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. Um, and what save was that again? Wisdom. Wisdom. Um, that's gonna be a twenty-two. Holy shit! Okay. <laughs> All right, next turn. I'm gonna look at you and I'm gonna say you have no idea. What is happening here? I should have cast Sacred Flame, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Next time, I won't mess. I won't mess up. Cormus! <laughs> what would you like to do? Uh. Okay, <laughs> Cormus is going to. Can I just run and get bet get somewhere between the two of them? Between the two of who? Uh. Ren and Maybe it's trying to kill each other? <laughs> yeah, sure. You can, you can get up to the. You can get up to the lady. So I think I get, I get in between. I get in between the two of them, and say, "Can we please? Just, can we talk this out? I've had enough fighting for the past two days." She should have talked it out when she used me to get victims she could sacrifice. You don't understand, child, what I am doing. What are you just, doing? Do I need to? Just, what are you doing then? <laughs> Remove the damn bird from my face, and then we can talk. Sounds She's good. still hitting at the sky. You had many chances to do that. Well, I don't drop concentration. Okay, guess we're killing Ren. What happens? What the fuck <laughs> is going on? Okay, <laughs> okay, okay, hold on. Tie up Ren. Okay, whoa, 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 it's still Cormus's okay. turn. What would you like to do, Cormus? Do I have enough, uh, do I have enough movement to go over to Ren and, like, try to pommel smash her with my sword to try and make her break concentration? Sure. You can make, uh, a melee attack against Ren. Uh, does the 19 hit you? Yeah. Okay. Okay, you're only gonna take one damage. Uh, what so my strength modifier is plus four. Oh, so you take f five damage. Uh. <laughs> and you need to make a concentration save. Yep. And so that's a DC. So constitution saving for the DC is ten. I fail. I got a nine. Okay, the bird just sort of goes away. She says, well, the lady stops and says, thank you. So, can we talk this out now? Depends on if you want to kill me or not. You've got blades out. I mean, at this point, they're kind of both. Okay. My daughter doesn't want to hit me. I mean, it's, okay, so I think, I think that's the end of my turn. Mm, what the fuck is going on? I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> there's, some, okay. there's some family issues. One person wants to kill the other. I don't. We don't okay. know who to trust. Some chick's talking based about forced like, stuff. Based on my moral compass here, I've got to say I'm sort of siding with Ren. But like I have Why? No idea she what the fuck randomly is going on. attacked this lady. We don't know anything about this lady. Didn't we fucking track this lady? And didn't you say that she threw someone into a fire? I uh, yeah, but she did it for the forest. Who knows? That might be a good uh, reason. These guys it's might still be still murder. These guys, <laughs> might, these guys might be killing murder. people. Isn't your no, but whole murder, thing, like, murder, murder is, is punishable by death. Murder is murder yeah, unless be... it is in the name of the law. Who oh knows? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> it could be the, in the name of the law and in the name of Since God. Since when did you know, get so specific in... with this murder is- I've always been very specific with it. Murder is murder unless it's in the name of the law. How do you know this okay. is in the name of the Period. law? Because we, we don't have murdered know. so This is not an innocent until proven law. guilty kind of thing here. It this is, is a what the fuck is going on thing. Like, <laughs> Yeah, that's why we're trying to figure out what the fuck is going on. So, <laughs> you know what? Combat's just been combat's currently out. So there's unless Noah, unless Growl wants to do something for his turn, everybody else is currently bickering uh, about what to do with the old lady. <laughs> Hello. 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 
Why can't we all just stop? This what would you like to do? I think his and he's his uh, <laughs> Wi-Fi is fucked again. Oh <laughs> <laughs> well. Okay. How's him so it leaving is and then crowd. rejoining gonna affect the recording? Lots of editing. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Have <laughs> fun. Uh, <laughs> we're just gonna we're just gonna pull. It, currently, the combat has stopped. The lady's just looking around it's like, some things need to be done, no matter how hard they are. And what are you doing? Could you explain yourself, please? <laughs> I can't take a, a side fully until both of you sit down and explain your points here. Okay. You want me to explain my points? Please. This woman raised me to bring her guests because I thought she was a sad, lonely old woman and she's been killing them. Okay. I have been... Yes, I had to bring me people. Yes, I have had them killed. They are not locals, and I have used them to keep this area prospering. Have you ever looked at the towns around here? Have you ever looked at, like, Alice Falls, for example? Have you not noticed how strange it is that they have sap running all year long? Who is letting that happen? Who is allowing this area to prosper as much as it is? And that is me. I am helping the locals. Hello. Hello. Okay, oh, so I'm you're here. helping the epic. locals by killing innocents? So, as soon as it's my turn, my internet dies. That's epic and cool. We're they are... <laughs> Oh, we're not in combat? They are, are you shitting no. me? Uh, not locals. Fine. They are invade. Some of them have invaded this land in Explain. their own ways. In their own ways, what are those ways? I need, I need details too. Alright, so she's xenophobic. This is cool. Okay, give, give me give me give me details. I need details to determine whether or not you were going to be arrested <laughs> or not. <laughs> I think she's a little past arresting. Go at this, point. this way. Okay, since you're not giving me details and um you're Clearly murdering people after I've asked for details, I would assume guilty and you're not my enemy. Kill her. Assume guilty. <laughs> Grau, would you hold like on, to, would you on, like you to reinitiate it? combat? Yes. No, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. No. Wait, you said have people killed. Are you killing them yourselves? Or are you just like You just you just watched her throw someone into a fire, dude. I'd like to point out this oh, was so my worst mistake. Oh, so now you're going yet. back to murder is punishable by death. I see how it is. No, no, but she <laughs> explained. She, I asked for a reason. She did not give one. So now we murder. It's a very she clear just, okay, step by no. step process, Bramble. I don't see what's not to understand. <laughs> I like to imagine Audrey's like with a piece of paper. I'm so fucking pointing confused. Like, yes, no. Okay, Bramble. I say okay, we Bramble. kill her. I'm just saying that's. I agree. As I agree. You so just Bramble, sort of how it works, As you Bramble. are bickering. We see she disappears. Crime. What? what? <laughs> <laughs> I can track her. Fuck. Can I see is if she no teleported one else, anywhere? Is no one else paying attention. <laughs> can I see can't if she be, teleported like, anywhere? Literally everyone was not paying okay. attention. Well, me yeah. and Arton were bickering. Ren. Yeah? You can make an Arcana check if you want to see what she did. If you want to kind of figure out what she did. What if she's just invisible? Shit, that's a, uh, six. Okay. Or wait, that's uh, a nine, She could actually. be invisible. She could have teleported somewhere. All you know is that she's somewhere out there. Now, our done. Mm -hmm. I would like you... Uh, you... Fee you suddenly, your mind... Your mind goes to a place. Oh, no. Is it my happy place? <laughs> no, it is not your happy place. Um, your mind has just gone to a place of actually complete despair, of the opposite of everything that you love. You love law and order and goodness, and this is a place of chaos and deceit and evil. No. Everything that Watching you stand that. against. Hell yeah. And you just see the world around you burning in this way. You watch the little bead boy be killed slowly. Yes, the, the little bead boy gets killed slowly over and over and over again in front of your face. I'm very upset now. <laughs> <laughs> Not the bead boy. Can I do anything to try and break out of this? Uh, da da da. Just give me a moment. I am looking at the thing. Ah. Oh. Yeah, you know what? Make make a make a saving throw. For what? Uh, of. Constitution. Let's go. I got big constitution. Oh yeah, I rolled a nineteen plus two. Okay. 
Well, actually, it shouldn't. It should have been wisdom. Actually, I messed up. Oh, wisdom? Up. Yeah, that's a nineteen plus two. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you you're after like a minute, and everybody else. I don't know what everyone else is doing at this time. You're probably trying to all figure out what where the lady went. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing. Yeah. Aggressively. Well, I mean, if I was talking to Ardon, would I like notice something is up? Maybe. Well, yeah. No, you guys just know. Like, well, the moment that she disappears, a few like a. A few seconds later, Ardren's eyes just sort of like glaze over and you can see he's not... It's like almost like he, he looks like he's having the worst nightmare of his life. Uh-oh. You can tell. And he's just... He's, he looks also in pain at the same time. Uh, now, Ardan, um, from all this, while you were there, I just want to point out you're going to take uh, four psychic damage. Okay. Just so you're aware, okay? But you managed to just sort of, after a minute, maybe, but it felt like hours for you. You break out of this. I mean, it's a long time combat wise, so it probably is stuff for a few turns, right? Yeah, well, I'm just wondering, I will, like, I'm cutting combat on this section right now, unless anybody else is trying to do something while Ardran is uh, not I feeling so good. Something. She's now, so what would you like to do? The witch. I could probably miss the fact that she cast invisibility uh, or something. Uh, uh, I want to try to contact Tree Lady, Maple Lady. Hello? Yes? Uh, be like, <clears throat> is what sh is this, like, sacrificing good for the lands, or should we stop this? Like, it's technically good for the maple, but it's, like, she's killing people. Ah. Uh, she's not one of mine. Izil Istora, she is not one of mine. I do not know. I am sensing this is old magic. Far from the ages far gone. Although, bef after I arrived, but millennia before your time, from the earlier people from this land, I would say she's doing something that she thinks is right, but I would not say it has anything to do with me or the whole land in general, just this part of it. Alright, I do love maple, but it's probably going to stop You do what you think is right. This does not interfere with my plans, Zil Astora. Good luck to you. I hope we speak again. Thank you. Soon. You 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 feel the wink. I feel the wink. You yeah. feel the wink. <laughs> I would also like to cast a message on my mother. Um and I'm gonna say, at least face me. <clears throat> did you just say what did you say again? Sorry. Um, I'd like I to cough. cast message um on my mother and say, at least face me. Okay, just give me a second. I gotta double check what message does. Um, it's a cantrip. Takes an action. Yep. Um, it needs to be a creature within. You need to point your finger feet. at a creature within range. Start spinning in circles. Yeah, I'm like <laughs> pointing like in the general direction of where she went. <laughs> um, and I'm okay. gonna try casting. Um, because I'm familiar with the target, and I know she's within this clearing somewhere. So. Okay, you're just you're just pointing around. Mm -hmm. Um. And I feel this like is the gonna, same effect would be just yelling. Anybody else want to do something for the quick minute that Aldan is not feeling so hot? I I ready my weapons. Yeah. Cormus has okay. Cormus still has a sword out and says, Isn't there some way that whatever this is can be done without killing people? I don't know. She will appear it's after the minute you everybody around Aldan just there's a moment when his eyes go clear, and you can see her take... She appears and takes her hands off of his hat. Taking her, her hands off of his temples. And now it is Growl's turn. <laughs> and she hears the message that you said to her, Ren. But she doesn't reply. With all due respect, I'm not exactly comfortable with the lady with her hand on the head at the moment. <laughs> 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 Every time I need Noah... He disappears. Yeah, his Wi-Fi is shitting itself. Going to use data. I've suggested that, and he doesn't do it. Eh, uh, well. Doesn't he have like a neighbor that he could like steal the password from? I think that would be worse. Okay, worse well, we're just gonna out. we're gonna we're gonna quick throop this. Uh, Tasa, it's your turn. It's my turn. Okay. Um, yeah. Are, are okay. What the fuck is going on? Have we decided that we're killing the witch? Yes. yes. I use magic missile. 
At least incapacitator. Okay. Um. Great. Make make your attack roll. Okay. Make your or roll for damage because it automatically hits. Okay. I do three rolls, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Unless you so, want to cast it at the higher level. Yeah, I'll cast it actually as like a level three spell then. So how many rolls is that then? Uh, look at the bottom of the spell. It'll tell you how many more you add for each one. Okay, hold on. You create one more dart for every spell level. It's, yeah, so you okay, roll so one more five? dice for every level up. So it'd be two more rolls. Okay, so two, two, four, uh, two, and three. She's currently right behind Ardan and just took her hands off of his temples. Uh, it's not your turn, so it doesn't matter. Close enough that you can run up and fight her. She takes 13 damage I'm from Magic Missile. I just got mine penetrated. Okay. Okay. Uh, got it. Now, um, is there anything else you want to do, Tassa? I don't think I have anything else I can do. Okay. Now it's Growl's turn. Growl stuttered for a moment, so... But he caught himself. A 22 does hit. <laughs> Hi, this is Anna speaking. Um, sorry to interrupt your regularly scheduled bullshit, but it appears that we lost some of Noah's recording, so if there are a bunch of pauses in the next little bit, it's because we don't have Noah's recording. Um, that's all. My apologies. Please enjoy the rest of the podcast. Is it a dex or a strength? I think it might have been... Well, what's the DC? Uh, menacing attack says it's a wisdom save. Okay, awesome. Uh, does a 9 work? Great. She is... Okay, cool. Well, I'm not gonna let you know that. Okay. That does not hit. Okay, that still doesn't hit. What? Uh, all of them. Uh, that does hit. Okay. Uh, that would be a... Uh, Strength. Uh, 20, so... Strength save. 20. So she just dodged that at your trip attack. Uh, now... Um... She just says, well, if you want a fight, I'll give you a fight. Who is the closest to the woods? I, I said I was going to stay in the back. Yeah, Izil, you're the near the back. Izil. Oh. The trees love me. Don't do this to me. <laughs> <laughs> you hear a rustling, and from behind you, you feel something slam into you. And that that hits. Hold. I rolled it. I rolled a twenty, my friend. But hold I, up. I crit. Um, you just feel. It's almost like the vegetation is alive and malaise. it slammed into you. Um, so you are actually going to take. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be. But I remain alert to danger, even when you are engaged in another activity. Yeah, you, you still take 17 bludgeoning damage. What the fuck? And you're gonna fuck. And you just feel it hit you again. Oh, um, I know. What's your armor class, by the way? 15. Yeah, I know this hits. I'm sorry. Fuck. Um, you, this time you only take 5 bludgeoning damage. However, I need you to make a strength saving throw. Uh, wait, actually... Um, no, no, no. A, uh, you are, you just, after the second slam, you just feel the vegetation engulf you. You are blinded, restrained, and unable to breathe. Sevi what the fuck? By the trees. Um, oh god, I know what these now, are. Now, now it is Ren's turn. You've so. just seen Izil has just been swallowed by this mound of uh, vines and roots that have just swallowed his body up. Oh wait, I just realized my fucking. Oh no. I'm. Uh, well, 
Well, I'm out. I, uh, I, like, look at my mother, and I look furious, and then I look at Izil getting, like, sucked into that, and I'm look visibly torn, and then eventually oh, I turn to the plants, and I cast a uh, firebolt on them. Wait. To try to, to get them to let them roll. go. <laughs> I'm gonna cook. That's, uh, gonna be a 16 to hit. Okay, that hits. And that is 19 fire damage. Okay. Great. You find it actually burns really well at it. Mm-hmm. Um, so that is... Awesome. Okay. And so wait, how much damage it is now that? your turn. You just feel yourself. Um, you're, you, you're having trouble breathing. Uh, you can try to escape if you can want. Uh, am I not well, out? First of all, actually, at this, um, yeah, no, you can try to escape if you want. You are grappled. Shit, okay, I will attempt to escape this. Okay. Make me a strength um, save. This is not going to go. Okay, so up. actually, note about the. I got an so eight. Note about the grappling rules. Yeah. You can use athletics or acrobatics to resist a grapple or to escape a grapple. I can. Oh, to resist. Yeah. No, but this I, the mm. effect of this automatically grapples the person. Yeah. So it's like grappling. You can use a escaping a grapple. You can use your action to escape a grapple using a strength athletics or dexterity acrobatics check. Okay. Okay, then that's a 15. Okay. Um, it's an acrobatics. You you find you can't get yourself out of the mound. Well, good luck, guys. You just hear it because he's, his face is engulfed in it. Um, Ardan, it is your turn. The lady is behind you. Um... I'm going to be very upset. Oh, Dan's gonna go dick on that in here. You know what I can do? I'm gonna try and. Hold on a You should plan your stuff before your turn, just so you guys know. Because <laughs> yeah, but I, I was time. gonna do something. I was gonna do something, but then I had a better idea, and I'm not sure if this will work because they're a wizard and they probably have a shit ton of wisdom, so they probably win the wisdom saving throw. I mean, wizards are intelligent. So I'm thinking I probably shouldn't cast hold person, but I'm really tempted to cast hold person. Do your other idea. The other idea is to smack her across the face with my mace. I like that idea. Okay, let's do that. I'm gonna go. Th- I'm gonna swing at her with my mace. Okay, I'm making a tackle. I roll a 15 plus six. That hits. Okay. Okay, she takes four damage. Awesome. Why do okay. why do maces like do no damage? Do one d6 bludgeoning. They're a worse version of war hammers. Okay, fair. Um, Cormus, it's your turn. This is literally a brick of steel at the end of a stick. If I got hit in the face by a mace, I'd take a bit more than six damage. I mean, a warhammer is just a bigger, heavier brick of metal on the end of a stick. True, but... And a maul is an even bigger, heavier brick of metal on the end of an even longer (laughs) stick. Exactly. Is that a wooden stick? I can make it a snake. (laughs) 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 Alright. Cormus, you're gonna say... Cormus is like growling hard, Hannah, dealing with the lady. I'm gonna go attack the plant. So I got two slashes Thank on you. it. Thank uh, you. I've got a 15. That just, you just managed to cut a piece of it. Yeah. Alright, so the first hit is gonna be eight damage. Okay. Uh, second attack is a natural one. So you actually cut into Izzel, make a damage towards Izzel, because he's in the tree. Ah! Eleven. You, you, uh, Izzel with your armor class. Oh, oh, Cormus, you have advantage because he's grappled. Stop! (laughs) Roll again. Oh, okay. Uh, Take the highest. Uh, other one is a ten, so. 
Okay. So uh. he just doesn't manage to. Th- you're you're okay. All right, and he, I'm and I'm going to. He gets dangerously close to your face though with the blade. I'm gonna action surge and make two more attacks. Okay. Uh, first one is a total of twenty. That hits. Okay, so that's gonna be ten points of slashing damage. Okay. And the next one is a natural twenty. Oh, nice. All right, so. Please remind me what crit rules we're using. Uh, you roll the you roll the dice twice. Fuck! I hate the I hate these crit rules, but okay. Sorry. Uh, seven, so the ones in the book. Yeah. Seventeen points of slashing damage. That's still pretty good. And that's all that I can do for this turn. Okay. Um, growl. It is now your turn. When in doubt, just type out the numbers, please. When because in doubt, just you're... type it out. You could have said, when it out, type it out. Owen. Is that a nat 20? Let's just assume it's a nat 20. Okay, cool. Then roll for roll for double damage. We are currently dealing with technical difficulties with Noah. Like we this do. This whole episode has been a technical mess. Ah. <sighs> if only we had Patreon money. While we wait, I would like to advertise our Patreon, Patreon page. <laughs> How would Patreon money fix <laughs> Noah's Wi Fi? Yeah. If you donate us $1, we will send it towards Noah's Wi Fi so that he can actually be in the calls. <laughs> or Noah's data plan. Exactly. Are you there, Noah? No? Okay, just roll damage twice. Speak, comrade, no. <sighs> We're already like half an hour over time. <laughs> does, anywhere, does anyone have anywhere to be in particular? No, but I have to get up early. I was sure. Okay. Summer school tomorrow morning as well. Gross. Um, congratulations, Growl, you, she fails the save. Awesome, I already got the 17 for damage, and she already failed the trip attack save. Awesome. Okay, How, did you do your extra damage? Okay. No. Okay, yeah. Awesome. Great. She looks really beat up. Okay. 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 Cool. Okay. So, after that... Um, she actually disappears again. I cast Counterspell. Great, it does nothing. <laughs> what? Oops. It's not a spell. <sighs> Alright. She, however, Ren, um, would you like to give me like a little arcana check? Sure. Natural 20. Awesome. She has actually pretty much became one with the planes, and so she's pretty much not here, but also here. It's like, imagine Doctor Strange when they enter the other world. No? That's broken. Yep, yeah, alright. Yeah, that's so broken. That's the best way to do it. So, you can tell that she is, she looked really beat up, she's probably running away somewhere. But you, you can't, no, you can't get there. The shit <laughs> I mean, if she's here, not here. Could I technically track her? No, she's in a she's in a different place. Shit. Technically, she's in the upside down. Yeah. Oh, however, Isil, you find um, now that she's gone, the the thing just sort of lets you go, and you get spit out in a heap of vines and dirt. I can fucking breathe. <laughs> we we need to find where she's going. 
I start like running in the direction of the cabin because that's the only other place I know of that she would go. Are you guys gonna follow her? I mean, I was actually about to suggest we go back to the cabin and see if we can salvage anything. There could be money left over. For all we know, there could be there could be something there. All right, I get up and start running. Let's go. <laughs> you guys get back to the cabin. Um, Ren, you can tell, you can just feel she is not here. She has ran away from you, from everyone, from the whole group. You j just know. However, you do find, um, in, well, okay. So when she disappeared, you did find Ren that she dropped this fancy ceremonial dagger of some kind. I take it. You have it, okay. And you can tell that this is whatever she... It's blood-stained with the blood of the fear bog that was thrown into the fire. Um, and you can tell it's magical. And but by the time that you guys get back to the burnt house, the ashes blowing in the wind, um, it feels late, although it isn't really. Um, looking through the ruins... Uh, you find uh, a few little things, not much. There appears to be a fancy looking rock, which Ren, you know, uh, you've seen in her study when you went in there once. There's also uh, a bunch of broken glass from different potions, but they're not sal. sal, you, uh, sal you can't save them. Um, there's a piece <laughs> of. There is a book, however, that appears to not be burnt. What is it? Uh, picking it up, the book is The Nature of Herbs and Druidic Magic. You got any druids here? I mean, if I, if, if I die, that's going to be my next character. It's so, partially no. legible. I set fire to it. Okay. Didn't, wasn't it already like in a fire? Yeah, it didn't burn fully though. Huh, okay. Yeah, burn it twice. Nothing wrong with that. Hmm? Or arson. We just burn the whole building twice. Though? Fuck yeah, arson. Do we, do we find anything mm, else? Who can hurt? <laughs> Are you winning? <laughs> <laughs> anything else we find? And that is just it. That's you don't find anything else really. There is. Uh, one silver coin that managed to not really be ruined by the fire. I... Dibs! What are you talking about? Dibs, give it to me. <laughs> I just said dibs. You can't dibs over my dibs. I can totally dibs on your dibs. I dibs on your uh, dibs. I, you dib. I've already dibs it. Fram, well, you so can't, it's mine. Fram, well, you Ran, can't it would have been part punching. of a little package of like coins that would have been in the house for situations where people needed to go into town. Mainly she would, whenever she would leave. You guys do realize this is my house, right? Well, why would you agree we to burn I mean, it down? I then? would call this more of a yeah. I would call I this did, more rubble than a. I can promise you payment. You withheld a lot of very critical information throughout this entire but, venture, and honestly, I'm not feeling too sympathetic at the moment. I never lied to you. No, but you withheld a lot of information that would have made this entire process way easier. So honestly, I, mean, I do not like you at the moment. The ding dong, the witch is dead. It's fine. <laughs> Everything's she's good. Which isn't even dead, but which is still alive. She's a verified lawbreaker and needs to be put down. I mean, I don't know that the witch is dead. I wasn't here for it because my ping was dead. So I'm just going to walk over and take that silver piece. Yeah, that's <laughs> All right, Chip, go for it. <laughs> okay. All right, Chip, go for it. Besides that, there's yeah. really nothing left. You can see pieces of the bed frames. Um, there is a storybook that is, again, half-burned the story. Here, Ren, have Well, us. none that you would be familiar with. However, Ren is aware of the story. And that would be, it is called Yours Truly in Waiting by Alina Levy. I put it in my bag. Okay. Aw. I want to Ready. Rough row. And that's about it. I don't know what else you guys want to do. I know you're not 
Leveling up would be nice. Happy with me right now, but Absolutely I not. did promise you payment. So here's all the coin I have, and I dump out my coin purse. And hey. here are some other things, and I p set down three potions. Thank you for Continue trying. Line. Do you want to describe what those are? Yeah. So one of them is, it seems like an amber-colored potion. Um, the other is a red potion, and the last one's a uh, green. Or actually, I set down four potions. Uh, the last one of them is a green potion, and the other one's kind of um, a bluish color. Um, and I describe what, what they do. These one of them do? is a potion of healing. One of them <laughs> is a potion of growth. One of them is a potion of animal friendship, and one of them is a potion of resistance to acid damage. I and take the potion of growth. <laughs> I'm gonna take the potion. Hey, of wait! Can I have the potion of growth? And the coin that I put down was seven gold pieces, fifty-one silver pieces, and twenty-eight copper pieces. And I completely emptied out my satchel. This sounds like a mission failed successfully, if you ask me. Yeah, kinda. Task failed successfully. I'm gonna take nothing. You sure? I'll take the money. I, you guys of course, you fucking I, take the money. I I pick up. <laughs> However many of the silver pieces Isil lets Isil lets me, and I hand them back None. to Ren. <laughs> you don't need to do that. Straight up not. I hired you for a job, and you did it to the best of your ability. Yeah, but we can't just... I mean, to be fair, we couldn't complete the mission. We kind of just burnt down your house. <laughs> and we, then, uh... we can't just accept everything that you have as payment. You do... Yeah, we can you need to have you need money so that you can survive out there. Man. I'll be fine. Okay, uh couldn't the church take take her in, Audrin? I don't think the church wants her. You're Why probably not? not wrong She's about that. She's a rat. Well, not for that reason. But... <laughs> <laughs> She's a rat. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure I have I... like a ruby that's worth like a hundred gold. Dips. You, it's mine. I get to decide what I do with it. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Ren, you seem to be in a little bit of a situation here. Um, do you want to take that? You don't need to do that. I'm probably not going to use it. I could use it. Shut up, Isil. <laughs> it's not your place to decide what I do with my ruby. I have two of them. Oh? You don't get the other one either. <laughs> it's mine. Oh, okay. That's... So selfish. I don't know why you, you give it to me, though. Corvid pals. <laughs> Corvid. <laughs> oh, yeah, because the bird. Also, right. if you don't... Listen, okay. If you don't have any money, and you don't have a house, likely you're not going to end up in a good position here. I would I'm say. I'm probably going to, anyways. Listen, you could probably sell this ruby to some unsuspecting little shit and be like, this is worth like 300 gold, and they'd probably believe you. So. That's called fraud. Please don't. <laughs> Shut up. I mean, the value of an <laughs> item depends on what's the value to the person. Exactly. So, because I am doing this out of the kindness of my own heart, it adds some value to it. So. If you take the ruby, it'll add like a solid like more value to it. And you can be like this ruby is really special to me. I'm selling it for a very high price because I need a house. So or just take it and stay it in an inn for a little while and you know see how things work out. I don't know. I'm trying to think of a place for her to stay, and I can't think of anything other than the church. I I guess the graveyard. Yeah, I can stay with him. <laughs> the fucking graveyard. Pete is back in Maniki, Pete, which is name, like yeah. Pete. I feel bad. I feel really bad for Mister Rumpel. His name. I like Pete. Okay. So if she went to the town nearby. She'd probably just end up a slave or something. Okay. So what what's happened here, uh, Ren? Are you gonna take the the gem that is being offered to you by Tassa? Kind of reluctantly, I am going to take it. Okay. Um, 
I, what I'm wondering also is who's taking what that Ren has been giving out so that I know what everyone has. I know that Noah ha keeps saying that he wants, he will take the acid resistance potion. I'm taking the potion um, of growth. Okay, there's a potion of healing and a potion of animal friendship. How do we know this is all what she says it is? How do we know these aren't all just like poisons? Well, you don't need to take anything out of <laughs> Yeah, I'm not taking anything. Check. Of course I'm not taking anything. Do you want me to Arcana check it? Yeah, go for it. Okay, I'll Arcana check it. Tassie, you know that they're all what she says they are. I'm just- you don't need to. There you go. Okay. It's- she's still telling not the truth. Anything. Okay. Is anybody else taking the other two potions? Uh, What kind of healing potion is it? Just normal it's potion? just a normal, yeah, healing, just potion. normal healing potion. Those things suck, to be honest. <laughs> Kind of do. You know, I'm, I, I mean, I could slap you for more health. <laughs> Guys, I just need to know what you're, what, what you're accepting. Okay, you know what? I leave her the money. She kind of needs it more than we do. She could also sell the potions, and I'll take the animal handling one actually. Okay, you've got a potion of animal friendship. No, it takes. We kind of failed the mission, so I'll take a partial acceptance, but you can keep the money. Okay. So, no, I'm just I, growl, I grab the it. other potion as well. Yeah, but you said you'd pay us if we kind of, like, killed her. To be honest, it's been like a day ago since we agreed to what to do. Alright. I'll okay. take back the money then. So. This bittersweet moment, I'm just gonna say, uh, you guys have a, it's pretty quiet, uh, the rest of the day. You guys stay overnight, and then... I don't. Oh, you, got, you don't? You just, you just up and out the moment you can? I'm not staying here. You can, Ren? Yeah, I mean, like, okay. as soon as all this like, is I mean, concluded... Not, the, not, you guys go back to where you camped last time. Okay. Like, no, you're not sleeping near the burnt out house. I'm kind of assuming people don't want me here, so I'm gonna probably just say my goodbyes here. Wait, like, hold on. The witch is still out there, yeah? Yes, she is. Straight up gonna kill you. Maybe. But... I kinda wanna escort her back to Maniki. She's probably gonna die. Maniki's what's like five days away from here. Yeah, what's the military situation at the town nearby? Bad. Uh... I don't know. It was it was like a well off town. Did did we it was see kind of what you would like, make out? How many guards did we see when we went into town? Like normal amount of guards. Normal amount of guards for a small town. Yeah. For for like a there. village. Bring it to whatever church is there. Okay. So. Are you guys going back to town altogether, or is Ren dipping out? I mean, if I mean, they... we're kind of going back to town to take Ren there. Then I guess I'll go with them. Okay, so you guys get back to town. Um, on the way there, Ren, mm -hmm. you hear a moment in your in your mind on the way, and it's like, uh, just just by yourself, you hear, "Sweet Ren, I am very sorry for the time, the troubles you've had." Would you like some help? Is that my mother's voice? No, it I is not. I say yes. <laughs> okay. Well, if you'd like, I can always use some more champions in and around. Wait. Some more help. And I am certain we can both get rid of your mother together. Wait. Wait. I'm not sure how I feel about the murderous spirit lady. I can also find you your actual parents if you wish as well. She's, wait, she's not my real mother? No, she's not your actual mother, little Ren. Uh oh. Your actual parents will surprise you. Number five will surprise you. <laughs> 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 It's Cormus' half sister! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Another half sibling. Last I time say I yes. Kill me, this one led me into danger. 
<laughs> okay. Well, when you're done with these other ones who I need to keep an eye on as well, we can talk. Just go to the inn, buy yourself a good soup, relax, sit back, and then we can plot how to find your... And you can sort of just feel the air quotes, mother. God, you're like... <laughs> Some of the characters you've been adding this session just make me uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> we can find your mother. Alright, um, after that, I'm definitely noticeably more cheerful on the way back to town. <laughs> Nobody else is monster. aware of what happened. <laughs> and so, you guys are back at the beach. A Hojo greets you. How'd it go? How'd it go? How'd it go? How'd it go? Did you kill the lady? Did you beat the lady? Did you kidnap the lady? What'd you do? Ooh. Uh, um, she got away. We don't have her, so kidnap fail. Oh, well. I think it's safe to say we beat her for now. Okay, and he... Mission failed he, successfully. He goes to Cormus's feet, and he just sort of, like, throws three copper pieces at your feet, and, like, change for you. Here you go. Thanks, Chief. No problem, That's boss. And he, he makes illusionary sunglasses. Interesting. Um, so yeah, you guys are at the beach. Ren, uh, you are with the group at the beach back in Alice Falls. I suppose this is where I'll say goodbye. Seems as good a place as any. Alright. I know. I'm sorry for not being forthright about everything. I figured people wouldn't necessarily be as open to helping me if I said, hey, let's go murder my mother. <laughs> the feeling I've had toward my brother a couple times. One he definitely has toward I mean, me, so. I'd beat the crap out of my dad if I had the chance. Um, Family issues. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> but hey. Well, blood it yeah, if you're if we ever come across you again in our travels, you're welcome to, welcome to spend a night by our fire. Thank you. Is and Lysander welcome as well? Oh yeah, there's the bird. Yeah, he was just in the woods for, for the entire fight. <laughs> I can... Did it could have helped. Shit happens and then the really. bird's like, I am a head out. He doesn't, he doesn't like my mother very much. There's so much more reason to just beat the shit out of her. I don't think she knew about him or he didn't ever direct her confront uh, confront her directly. I don't know what his reasons are, but I trust his judgment. So if he doesn't want to see her directly, then I'll respect that. Nice. He was the sketchbird. He was the one who told me about all of that, though. I he led me into her study, and I found her spell book, and I had no idea what was going on before then. So I owe a lot to Lysander. Okay. He's good. And so, I'm guessing you guys part ways? Yeah, I go into town after that. Yeah. yeah. Ren, you go into town, you go to the inn, and you have an interesting conversation with the Maple Lady. She introduces you to who she is, who she knows, what she knows about your past, what she knows about you, which is surprisingly a lot. And she produces a plan for how to find your mother, where she is, and what you can do next. The party, you guys group back on the river, sort of contemplating your bittersweet victory, maybe? Still a bit unsure about that. Mission failed successfully. Exactly. 
as the day goes on, Hojo just looks at Cormus, looks at the rest of you and says, Okay, bosses, what next? And that's where we're going to end the episode today. So, I hope you guys had fun. Uh, <laughs> this was kind of intenser. The last few episodes have been kind of intense, emotionally-ish. I've been- I called so much stuff that happened. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the second you said run was sketchy, everything. I was just like, oh hell yeah. Um, yeah. So, I hope you had fun playing with everyone, Maddie. <laughs> I honestly really regret the ho not doing the whole tie-up with the rope play. I feel like if we had <laughs> I done that- I told you it would have been a good idea. <laughs> that would have been yeah. great. <laughs> See how things progress there. Are we stopping when recording now? When in doubt, out? pull out the rope. Uh, we are still recording because I want to give people a bit of time to say if Maddie wants to say anything, and then I gotta advertise Patreon. I had a lot of fun. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, it was fun. I enjoyed it. It was a good time for the, like, hour that I was there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was gonna fucking, on my turn, I was just gonna whip out a throwing axe and yeet it at the witch. I'm a little sad I wasn't able to do that. I mean, if it makes it feel any better, my action today was getting freaking. Oh yeah, <laughs> you got fucking. I managed to like deal a shit ton of damage. You just get like, f just me doing shit ton of damage. Easy old ramped in fines. Work, right, work. So yeah, I'm glad you had fun. Uh, glad you guys all had kind of fun. It was a bit weird. Uh, we need to fix Noah's Wi-Fi. I'm just gonna. Um, honestly, I'm really debating just, just quitting my job and just moving back to my dad's. Honestly. <laughs> This is the Wi-Fi here is so terrible. Um, yeah. So, Maddie, anything else you wanna say? I. It was really. I, that didn't shake out the way I expected it to, but I really liked the way it ended up going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, we might end up. You know what? If Ren comes back, uh, there's, we can always figure out what happened to Ren in the future. Sure. I'm interested. I wonder what yeah, happened to the burn down our next house. murderous witch lady. Yeah. Well, Can maybe. I'm gonna sidetrack there. Maybe if you got a Patreon and joined our Patreon, <laughs> oh you would find out <laughs> all the bonus, <laughs> bonus Some... content and stuff like that, uh, which Some... would be available to you, unless we do an episode on it. But if we do an episode with uh, Ran reappearing, you're gonna be missing all of her middle story. Yeah. So, join our Patreon. Not that take much. Your toes. Even a dollar gets you in a special part. Noah, stop threatening people. Subscriber, <laughs> Noah takes your bonus. Oh, that's a dollar. Toe taking um, is perfectly acceptable. Yeah, so if you want to join our uh, Patreon, there will be a link in the description for the video. Just go ahead, click the link, uh, pledge us some money, and we would love your support. Mm -hmm. It'll let us make better content than this, like, fix Noah's give, Wi-Fi. Uh, give us money so that we, Noah can quit his job and, uh, get, have still have wifi. an income. I'm yeah. gonna have, <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna get my first, I'm gonna get my first day. paycheck, I'm just gonna fucking quit, and then go like, hi, goodbye. Cause this uh, contract also works, it'll let us fucking have, goodbye. um, better mics. So, for example, Ian won't be using a phone to record his stuff, and all that jazz. Mm -hmm. Anyways, besides that, I should also mention we have a Discord, which is where we record all of our stuff off of. Um, it's relatively decent. We Come haven't check it out. figured out how the recording works on Discord yet. Like, we haven't edited that kind of stuff yet. Yeah, no, but I'm pointing out, you know what, if you like our show, come join our Discord. Yeah, join our I, Discord and there's vibe. There's memes um, from the episodes. There's also... Um, what else do we have in here? The uh, occasional lore dump lore. by Owen. Yeah, lore dumps. Um, every day, usually every day, not every, but if not every day, every now and then, a head, you'll see headlines from the Catalia Chronicle, which is kind of the local newspaper for the whole region of what's going on in the world uh, relative to what's been going on in the stories. And they are worth checking out if you got a moment. Um, so yeah, come come join us on our Discord. I don't think there's anything else we need to say, so... Without further ado, I guess we should say goodbye to everyone, right? Okay. 
Goodbye. Yeah. Goodbye. 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 Bye. Bye. Bye.